Good morning, Ali Ashton here. Quick update on the hobo I'm making from this old bomber jacket. Um, I will post in the comments below the first video that I put out of the before shots of the jacket. Uh, but for now, um, I just want to do a bit, bit of a progress check. It's always hard to get a full day's work in when it's school holidays, but I'm getting somewhere and I'm pleased so far so good. So, I've got one panel of the bag here. This is probably the front panel. I've got pocket there, pocket there, and a, a, a fake pocket there, but obviously the one pocket that was originally the pocket, but it was very deteriorated, the lining, etc. So, I've just used the two usable pockets on there. On the reverse, I've used the waistband... Um, clips and uh, detail just to give it a bit more interest than a plain back and then the gusset which I'm about to attach is the from memory I think these are from the sleeve um, so I've done them like so that will be like this and then moving on to whoops, moving on to the lining, it will have the rings on again. Um, yeah. Um, moving on to the lining, we've chose um, this cotton uh, this cotton um, shirt. On this side, we have I've just halfly half halfly made that word up. I've just taken half the pocket off there because I'm going to put a leather trim on. That's for the phone pocket just to give it longevity. And then on this side, I will be adding a zip pocket for personals, uh, purse and keys and whatnot. Gusset. It's been a little bit of a... Um, piecing together um there's there was a lot of little panels on this coat um so i've yeah i'm pleased i'm pleased with how it's looking so far i've literally saved that leather there and that leather for the handle that goes across i'm just looking actually at those clips uh they are actually different colour to the hardware that's already on the coat so I may be sourcing something that matches in a little bit better maybe some antique brass rings not sure yet that's all a bit of a work in progress I've got a box of old buckles and rings that I go through and I will find something a little bit more suitable so that's it really if you're thinking of making one of these bags um you can literally it's quite a big pattern it's a big bag big finish bag but it literally any of these styles of jackets uh, will be suitable for your hobo um, just might mean a little bit more sewing together of panels just to make the bigger pieces but um, it wasn't a particularly big coat to start with so yeah i will show you the finished bag in the morning thanks for watching Bye.